Are you guys seeing what I'm seeing? One singular booba is bigger than her entire head. Boa out here breaking uh, Guinness World Records, bro. Speaking of chest sizes, <laughs> I recently learned that <laughs> Zoro has the biggest chest out of all the straw hats. Oh my god, dude. Dude, I love how <laughs> Luffy just does not even know what he did. Dude, if Luffy does learn how, how to control it, though, he's going to be broken. But yeah, my boy ain't backing down. But yeah, bro, this has got to show people in the crowd that Luffy is actually a good person. Bro, that is so nasty. Wait, what? Will the smoke not let him use... Oh, it dissolves whatever it touches? <laughs> Chat! Y'all don't gotta violate Boa's sisters like that, bro! Ain't no way y'all just called this one Lizzo! <laughs> Hey, bro, she do got the dump truck, though. I cannot lie. Damn, so he healed that fast from the poison? Or he recovered that fast? <laughs> Chat saying maybe plot armor. True. It could also be that. Dude, Balloon has got to be one of the goofiest attacks Luffy has. Bro, but the thing is, though, she can literally just spit more poison. <laughs> Unbelievable! He just used his breath to disperse the poison. What is she going to do now? Oh, gear? Second gear? I'm telling you, bro, if he can combine hockey with the gear, that is going to be so broken. Wait, so if he's going full power, is he going to combine third and second? Damn, Shorty got a long neck. Oh? Ribozo? <laughs> Bro, the reason why his attacks bounce off of her is because of all that fucking fat. <laughs> Dude, Luffy found out her weakness. Bro had to push her big ass down the stairs knowing that she couldn't climb back up. <laughs> But so much for being some of the strongest people on this island. How dare you let a man beat you? Luffy versus feminism. That is what this fight is, bro. <laughs> oh, shit. Bro, Loki, I thought bro was gonna go third gear. Bro, Luffy got the whole crowd pogging. <laughs> she fucking... <laughs> she fucking burning her own sister. Luffy did the most basic of attacks in one. Luffy just proved that men are physically stronger than women, and that is just science. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm going to get canceled, bro. I got to chill. 
It's just jokes. It's just jokes. Oh, oh, I forgot she had the eyes on her back. See, bro, this has got to prove to Boa that he's good. Luffy's basically protecting the treasure, I guess. Although it's like a curse, but still. Oh, shit. Wait, did she used to be, like, tortured and locked up? Damn, bro. That is actually kind of crazy. That Luffy, because of that little moment, was able to change Boa a little bit. Because let's be honest, Boa's personality is shit, bro. But obviously, there's got to be more to it. Because I couldn't really tell what the fuck was going on and, like, the things she was remembering. But it would not surprise me if she went through some hard shit because of the curse. In some sort of similar way, it's probably almost the same as, like, Robin a little bit for being, like, the devil child. But this is why I love Luffy. Everywhere he goes, bro, he leaves some sort of impact on people. You know what? I'm going to be honest. Originally, I did not think we would ever see Boa cry. Just because of the way she acts and how, like, kind of stuck up she, she seemed. Damn. <laughs> Bro's like, you want these hands next? Bro, Boa's got to turn him back. Oh, what if she can't, though? Okay, so she can. Never mind. Bro, she better not be like, I don't want to. Oh, my God. Really? Really? You really can't let that shit slide, bro. After literally what he just did for y'all? Oh! What? What? That is fucking insane. Bro would literally sacrifice getting help from them to find his crew just to save people he just met. There was no hesitation, man. She's got to respect Luffy after that, bro. <laughs> My boy just cheesing. <laughs> Sweet pea! Damn, bro, is nobody gonna tell him? See, bro, there's no way you can hate Luffy, man. Especially with his big ass smile, man. There's no way you can hate him. Ugh. I do not like the way she talks. <laughs> my, my boy just wanted some meat. Oh? Okay. I cannot lie. The degenerate inside of me wants to think that she is naked. But it's gotta be too... It's too good to be true. What? What? <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, he's showing her. Or she's showing him. Wait, did she get... 
Oh, what? Did she get branded? <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, I guess it is kind of similar. I thought she had snake eyes. <laughs> oh, chat! I know you guys cannot see this, but it's buggy. Dude, Luffy does not know, like, how big of a deal that really was. Oh my god, dude, the punch, man. Like, the government does not like Luffy right now. Bro literally fucked up in his lobby, then punched a celestial dragon, like... Bro is in some deep shit, but just puts a big ass smile on his face. Hell yeah, bro. The celestial dragons deserved it. Oh, she's trembling. Wait, did a celestial dragon do something to her? Wait, what if she used to be like a, a slave? Like him? Wait, who is she talking about? The claw of the celestial dragon? So they branded her! What? Oh my god! So the snake eyes, the curse of having the snake eyes on their back was like a thing they made up to basically lie to the people of the island so they don't see the true thing that's actually on their back, which is the brand. Dude, what? I did not expect that, bro. Holy shit. Dude, isn't that... I feel like that's kind of awful, though. Because although she isn't, like, with the Celestial Dragons anymore, she's still kind of tied to the government, the ones that caused her all this pain, bro. That's awful. Oh, my... Bro, they used to look so normal. Oh my god, so they kidnapped him. This makes me hate the Celestial Dragons even more, bro. Dude, I cannot even imagine how painful, like, a brand would be if somebody branded your skin. And honestly, I can't even blame Boa for hating men. If all if a bunch of men did that to her, bro, I I honestly cannot blame her for hating men. That made the world government tremble. Oh, oh! So somebody broke in there. Fisher Tiger? Okay, so this dude was dope. Oh, so I guess he he freed Boa then. So what does he look like? Oh! So Hachi used to be a part of his crew then. Oh, that's kind of sick. So they turned that old negative meaning into something like positive and like a symbol to like free their people. That's fucking sick. Dude, that's insane that Hashi used to be a part of something like big like that. Oh, he's already dead? 
Damn. So Arlong was like a subdivision of that original group. Damn. Did you know damn well this is going to get Luffy fired up too? So maybe also too a reason why Boa wanted to become a warlord and stay a warlord is so like having that title of warlord and being like a really powerful figure people wouldn't suspect that she was she used to be a slave to the celestial dragons hell no fuck no luffy does not judge bro hell yeah bro if honestly if luffy could he would punch the celestial dragon again bro Dude, let's go. Dude, Boa's... Dude, I like this side of Boa. Like, the real Boa. Because I feel like her real self... Because I, I feel like she obviously had to put up this, you know, tough act because of how fucked of a past she had. But I really do like her, like, wholesome side, bro. Like, she's actually really adorable. She's more adorable whenever she's wholesome, man. But dude, I did not expect Boa's backstory to be this good. Yeah.